so in this video i'm going to show you exactly how you can get started with our special boom and crash ai spark detector installation guide and setup tutorial so let's dive in now so uh, this uh, setup tutorial is simply according to just three simple steps. Step one, you are going to acquire the AI document. Step two, uh, install the AI document. And step three, you can run the AI document. These are the three simple steps that we're going to take in order to make sure we got the AI spark detector intact. So if you have gotten the AI spark detector document, what I mean by that, if you have bought the robot from MLQ5 store, you'll be able to get this folder. I'm showing you right now this one. If you also buy it from us through our email or through our live chat, you can be able to have the same files downloaded at the end of the transaction. These are the main files you only need in order to offer it. For those that want to backtest it, there is a demo version. I will leave the link in the description. You can check the link in the description and you can be able to download the demo version and use. So if you open this folder now, uh, you will see it's a zip folder. I mean, it's already locked, so you have to unzip it extract here yeah so you can see we have the main files so you open you have the main custom settings don't touch this we have the robot that is the ai spec detector itself i will also have the templates so what you are going to do you're just going to copy this custom template just copy it come down to your pc go to your local disks uh, create new folder create new folder first if you just create this new folder let's say ai spike i'll just leave it or okay you can even write your name let me write let me write my name Hassan. you don't even need to tell somebody this is what this folder is entailed or something you can just unpaste your folder here if you just face this here, then you are good to go. So you just close this. You just close this. And also come down. Excuse me, come back to the folder again. Um, I'm coming. Yeah. So come back to this folder again. This robot. Often it copy this one, copy it, open your MT5 terminal. If you open your MT5, that is the second step. So the first step you already have gotten the files, and the second step you are going to copy the files to your MLQ5 data folder. Go to files, open data folder, loading. You can see go to MLQ5. Go to experts, advisors. You see, a aspect detector is already here. But had it been is not here, I would just paste something like this. If I paste, it, let me paste this now so that you'll see how it was. Should I paste it? You show me that there is another thing already. So I can either decide to replace it or skip this file. Simple. So as you just paste this here, you see, add back to you see, also close this folder. If you close this folder sometimes it's going to close the mlq file but it's not a problem as you just close the folder so you just click on refresh come to arrow click your arrow here open your arrow here just click on refresh one refresh two so you'll see the ai spy detector is here on the advisors look at it is the tough one and if you decide <coughs> excuse me if you decide not to Open it here, you can just close this MLQ5, you close it completely and you run it and you will see the AI results start to appear here. So you have seen that here by the despite the structure here as you just click on it. Uh, our next video will be how we are going to configure all those things, but so now that's not what we are going to do. As you just click on it. If you want to algo trading trade you click allow, you click allow algo trading here and click OK. And also allow algo trading here. So like this. The AI spark detector will be trading for you automatically. It will be done to be executing trade for you. It will be done to analyze the market for you. 
or if you opt this algo trading now it will only be analyzing the market for you and be giving you signals whenever there is a special signals for you to take the trade and let's just say this is for 1000 that is one is already running so if you want to confirm whether it's running you can just come here and click on it you'll see this and you'll see that it's showing spread here and it's showing that the system is working so this is exactly how to set up and install our special boom and crash AI spark detector in your PC. And in my next video, I'm going to talk about how you can be able to install it on your phone as well. For those that want to be using it with your phone as well, there is also a big way for you to be running your AI spark detector in your phone automatically. So in my next video, I'm going to show you how you are going to configure the boom and crash AI spike detector. So nice to have you now. See you in my next video. Bye.